Good afternoon and welcome to Friday, May 12th. Uh, this is Rob's video blog or vlog as I guess we sometimes call it. Um, hey, I know it's a busy time of year. We've got testing going on. People are getting ready for graduation, moving up ceremonies, students of distinction. There's just a ton of different activities going on. I hope uh, you're able to manage that stress and have some balance in your lives through exercise and uh, just taking care of one another. Um, I do appreciate all the efforts on, on everyone's part. It's also the Friday of Teacher Appreciation Week, so hip hip hooray for our teachers and all the work that our staff do in terms of uh, supporting our kids and our parents and our community and making this a great place. Um, we have a survey out right now called Thought Exchange and I wanted to bring your attention to that um, because we're really asking for information about uh, your thoughts around our facilities. We did one earlier, uh, just sort of a general, what are you concerned about, what do you appreciate, and what are your questions, and when we tallied all those responses, we had over 2,800 responses, and with those responses came uh, three major themes. One was about facilities, one was about class size, and one was about growth. And to me, all of those kind of come along that same lines about facilities. And so we, at that point, decided to create a facilities planning committee. And that facilities planning committee has been looking at all of our buildings, not just our school buildings, but our transportation, maintenance, our central office buildings, to see how they are doing in terms of uh, serving the needs for our community and our students and our staff. This next survey, though, now gets a little bit more specific, and we'd like to hear from you what your thoughts are around our facilities in terms of what might be some solutions uh, as we deal with our growth and the capacity in our buildings. What might be some options for us when we look at um, trying to upgrade and uh, bring our facilities up to the 21st century? It's a short survey, should take about 10 minutes max. Um, there's a couple of different cycles to it. The first cycle is the general questions and then you get everybody's uh, answers back to you and you can star those and kind of prioritize them and, and that prioritization helps us then look at how we can um, maybe come up with a solution that meets the needs of the community and is in line with what the community wants. So if you haven't had a, that email sent to you, it's a general email from your building principal or from me that asks you to fill out that survey. If you hadn't ha don't have that, you can be up on the screen and, and that'll give you a, the general link in which you can go and find um, the link for the survey and fill that out and get that back to us. It's open until May 24th uh, and at that time we'll start generating all the responses and then uh, prioritizing that and, and going from there. So um, again, it's called Thought Exchange. It should be an email that comes from either me or your building principals and if you didn't get one you can just use the email address on my right and that will help you to give us your input about how you feel about our facilities and, and growth and class size and capacity for our district. So. That's what's going on today on Rob's video blog. Thank you again for tuning in. And again, look forward to the Thought Exchange survey coming your way soon. Thanks very much. Have a great day.